It's the biggest day of King Charles's life. But who's invited to the coronation in May? And who has been left off the guest list? King Charles III's coronation will be part of a multi-event, three-day weekend of festivities. The ceremony itself is set to take place on May 6, 2023. The event will be divided into several parts and two separate processions. To begin in the King's procession, King Charles and Queen Camilla will travel by car from Buckingham Palace to Westminster Abbey. Next, Charles and Camilla will be crowned at the Abbey in front of approximately 2,000 guests, including many royals. While Queen Elizabeth's ceremony took three hours, Charles's coronation service will be significantly shorter. The end of the service will then kick off a second, more lavish parade known as the Coronation Procession. As the newly crowned king and queen consort make their return to Buckingham Palace, like the ceremony, this procession will be shorter than the five-mile route that followed Queen Elizabeth's 1953 coronation. Even so, the Times has reported that the palace described the planned procession as amazing in both scale and splendor. Charles and Camilla will lead the way, of course, this time riding in the Gold State Coach. This four-ton gilded coach has been the official coronation transportation since 1821. Even with a shorter route, the procession will still take a while, since this historic, heavy heirloom travels at walking speed. Fellow royals who participated in the pageantry will travel in their own carriages. According to recent reports, you can expect about 15 of them. Plans for the coronation show that William, Prince of Wales, and Catherine, Princess of Wales, will participate in the coronation procession, alongside their children. While Princess Charlotte and Prince Louis are expected to watch the service as guests, Prince George may also have a role during the service itself. Princess Anne and her husband, Vice Admiral Sir Tim Lawrence, will also be in the parade, along with Prince Edward and his wife Sophie, Duchess of Edinburgh. Besides his siblings and their spouses, King Charles has invited some of his mother's cousins in recognition of their royal service. Prince Richard, the Duke of Gloucester, and his wife Birgit, the Duchess of Gloucester, are planning to participate. At age 78, Richard has been a working royal since the early 1970s. Like her husband, the Duchess is also a working royal, with a diverse portfolio of over 60 patronages. Prince Edward, Duke of Kent, and his sister, Princess Alexandra, are the final members of the royal group. In addition to their connection to Queen Elizabeth, Edward and Alexandra are also second cousins to Prince Philip. In choosing his list of royals participating in the coronation procession, King Charles has relied on a familiar criterion, status as a working royal. This means that Prince Andrew will be the only one of the king's siblings who won't be in the procession. Andrew stepped aside from royal duties in 2019, after being accused of sexual assault by Jeffrey Epstein victim Virginia Giuffre. His very attendance at the service presents a special challenge for the king, since Andrew lost his royal titles in early 2022. My judgment was probably colored by my um, tendency to be too honorable. Like their father, Princess Beatrice and Princess Eugenie won't be involved in the coronation procession since they don't work for the firm. Back in 2016, the Daily Mail reported that, while Beatrice was interested in pursuing a royal job, Charles is planning to lead a slimmed-down monarchy with fewer working royals. In addition, since they stepped down as working royals in 2020, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle won't be in the procession, even if they do decide to attend the service. In accordance with this precept, the Sussexes weren't part of the balcony group at Queen Elizabeth's Platinum Jubilee in 2022. Of the adults participating, the only exception to the working royals only rule is Princess Anne's husband Tim Lawrence. However, Lawrence could be described as an unofficial working royal, since he has accompanied his wife during her numerous royal appearances.